let us now understand certain functions and how you draw their graphs. The first function is an identity function. Let's say you have a set R. Okay? Now, the word identity itself signifies that this has something related to each other. So, let's say you have a set R. So, then in this case, you have, you have to divide or define a function R to R, which means one R and other R, wherein y is equal to fx is equal to x where x belongs to a real number. Then in that case basically what is happening is that in this equation you are putting y is equal to x. So whatever value you get here the same value you will get here. Right? If you have 2, 2, minus 1, minus 1, 3, 3. So let us take a certain set of values for x and y. Let me use a different color. Let's say x is equal to 1, then y is equal to function x is equal to x. So y will also be equal to 1. Similarly, if x is 2, y is equal to 2. If x is 3, y is equal to 3. If x is minus 1, y is equal to 1. If x is minus 2, x is equal to 2, 2 minus 2. And so on. Now if you plot these points on the graph, let's call this as y-axis, x-axis, x complement, y component. So you have x is equal to 1, y is equal to 1. So x is equal to 1 lies here, y is equal to 1 lies here. So this point should be somewhere over here, A. This will be 1, 1. Then let's, okay, let's define these points as A, B, C, D, E. B, 2, 2. So x is 2, y is 2. So you get B, 2, in fact, it might just become a bit clumsy, so I'm just removing these references from here and just plotting down these points. C3, 3, 3. So x is 3, y is 3. So something like this. Then minus 1, 1. So minus 1 is here. x for minus 1 is here, so this point should ideally lie here. Minus 2, 2. Again, this point lies here. Now if you join these dots, you will get this line and the equation or the function or the relationship between x and point y for this will be y is equal to x. This line is also known as y is equal to x. Why? Because the identity of y is always equal to x. So this is also known as the identity function. So if suppose someone would tell you, tell you, what do you mean by an identity function? An identity function is a function wherein x belongs to real numbers and y is equal to x. The graph for this will be a straight line which will fall, pass through the origin or zero as we call it. And any point on this line will be such that the value of x will be equal to value of y. So let's say suppose you take it to this level, you want to find out this point, you basically draw a graph, draw a perpendicular on this side. So here you get x is equal to 13 and y is equal to 13. Because we haven't used the exact graphs, the situation might be a little different here. But in principle, whenever you plot any point on this line, whether it be on this side, this side, the value of x is always going to be equal to the value of y. 
and this function is basically called the identity function. 